lump sum investing usually comes into play when a person has a certain amount of capital that they intend on deploying into Bitcoin. And let's say that certain amount is $10,000. All right, let's keep the number simple. It could be 1,000, it could be 10,000, it could be 100,000, it could be a million, it doesn't matter. But you have a lump sum. Now, what's better with the lump sum? Is it better to just keep the lump sum on the side and just ease in with a dollar cost averaging approach until you deploy the entire 10,000? Or is it better to just take the 10,000 and dump it into Bitcoin all at once, at one point, one day, one moment, and you're in, all right? That's typically when lump sum becomes a topic, when someone has more than their weekly amount available, and they want this, this amount to be in Bitcoin. But how do they get the lump in? Do they break it up into four parts and do one part every month? Do they ease it in over a four-month period? Or do they just dump it all in? Okay, well, that's what lump sum is. Lump sum comes into play when you all of a sudden come into a decent amount, a lump sum that's way over and beyond what you're doing on a weekly basis. How do you deploy that? That's lump sum.